Welcome back everyone. Let's do this bumper cover on this Dodge Dart. So first off, welcome back everybody. This is a 2013 Dodge Dart, hit in the front. Let's go ahead and change this front bumper cover. So you have some little clips. And if you don't have a clip puller, you can get under there with a flathead screwdriver. Like so. And you can kind of pop them up. But I need two hands to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and pull the rest of these out with my clip puller and I'll be right back. Okay, that guy's off. So now we have some more clips and some 10 millimeter bolts along the front. Alright, you got all those out. Now we got to get this center grill out. And it just kind of snaps in there. So we're going to go ahead and pull that out. Right like that. Now we got this. So, got 10 mil bolts. 10 mil bolts. Okay, all those are done. You actually don't have to take this top part off. I screwed up. I forgot it's a two piece front bumper cover. You have the bottom and then this little top piece. Um, so, on each side of the fender, they just kind of snap in, much like that right there. Um, but we have some bolts in here we got to take out. I think they're little 7 mils. So we'll go ahead and do that quick. And then we have a 10 mil right in this corner right here. So I'm going to go ahead and get this inner fender out, get that bolt out. And then there's going to be a bunch of little bolts along the bottom also that we've got to get out. Those should be 7 mil as well. So all those bolts down below and, and then fender well are actually 8 mil. So now we have that lower grill to take out. Just a couple of 8 mils. Go ahead and pull those out. And then the other part of the grill is just clipped in with those. And then same goes with the fog light assembly. You just kind of pinch that and push out. And then the fog light just clips in too. Then you're going to want to take all these little clips off. I don't have a whole lot of them because I'm missing half of it. And there you have it. It's off. Again, you know, you'd have some clips on this side too, you know, but nothing major. So, there you have it. When I get the, when the new bumper's done drying, I'll go ahead and video of putting that on too so stay tuned all right here we are back with the good bumper i got it set on and i got those first four bolts put in um and obviously this stuff you just kind of snap in and then you'll have that 10 mil bolt down there and one over on the other side also. So I'm going to go ahead and put some of these in. Remember all those little clips you saved? Those go right there on both sides. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'll be back. All right, now we're going to put that thing on. Because, you know, we're stupid and didn't need to take it off anyway. So we got a bunch of clips and a couple bolts. So I'm going to go ahead and put the clips in. And then I'll throw some bolts in. Okay, now let's snap that piece in. So we're just going to line it up. And push it in. There you go. I got a couple bro broke clips, but I don't really care. So let's throw these things in now. I actually probably should have put these in before I did the rest of it, but um, I'm going to slide this in from below. Remember, it just snaps in, and then that guy snaps on top of it. Okay, I'm not going to lie. Putting that in made me want to drink bleach, so do that before you put the bumper cover on. Okay, now we're going to put those 
eight mils on down there. I'll pop that fog light in when I get one. So yeah, there we go. Rum bumper on this stupid dart. So, if you have any questions, shoot me a message or comment. But like, subscribe, share us. Deuces.